Some surprising audio recordings have surfaced of a phone conversation nearly a half century ago between President Richard Nixon and future President Ronald Reagan. The recordings were released by the National Archives, and they capture the two men using racist language. Here's White House correspondent Paula Reed. President Richard Nixon recorded himself talking to then California Governor Ronald Reagan in October 1971, the day after the United Nations voted to recognize the People's Republic of China. Reagan had phoned Nixon at the White House to vent his frustration at African delegates who celebrated the vote. The Ronald Reagan Presidential Foundation said today, if he said that 50 years ago, he shouldn't have, and he would be the first person to apologize. After talking with Reagan, Nixon called Secretary of State William Rogers and adopted Reagan's racist language. He saw these, as he said, these, uh, these cannibals on television last night, and he said, nice. he said they already worn shoes, and he says, here, the United States is going to submit its fate to that. Later that month, Nixon laughed at these comments from his best friend, B.B. Rebozo. You know, that reaction on television was it proves how they ought to be still hanging from the trees by the tail. <laughs> Even in 1971, that language would have shocked the general public. President Trump has, of course, come under fire for his racist tweets, but he said yesterday he is the least racist person there is in the world. Nora. All right, Paula Reed at the White House, thank you.